Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex. Get out of the way, chair. As you know, we are under the sea, and we are located here on this uh, particular image. The area here, labelled with T. As you can see from the site map here, I've got a good idea of how the area is going to look, which we completely neglected last video. Let's not enter in further, shall we? Okay. Got to keep our wits about us. For any alternative pathways. I believe here is a particular boss fight that could be had at some point. Might be a little bit later in the game. But it will be fought, fought here if we choose to fight it. Which is uh, always good to have a, an idea of beforehand. We do have some breezes, we might as well finish them off. Oh, little, little baby khaki in as well. Hello. Oh, we're out of, we're out of darts. Oh dear. Alright, chasing down. No quarter. Oh dear, I've been poisoned. I'm so poisoned right now. Chase him down. That's, that's not legs. There you go. Uh, let's regenerate, shall we? We're a little bit sick. Good, that's a magicistic healing right there. There's no one more. Where are we? There you are. You running away from me? I don't think so. Oh, hello. Don't you dare evade me, fools. Oh, I'm so evaded right now. Okay. You may be able to tell, I watched like Zoolander three weeks ago, and for some reason that particular phrase has rubbed off. Oh well. We can't get to take these lockpicks though. Uh, those lockpicks certainly went down smooth. Okay. There's an area in there which we just shone our light in to give our way our position. There's also this lever. Hello lever. I'm going to pull you about looking at you, see what you do. There you go. Oh, that makes the whole area electrified. That's interesting. Might be useful in the future to know about that. We can just electrify the the ground. It seems we can't stop that once we start it. Hope we didn't need that. That's a very long, very strong door. Oh, I see it's timed. Okay, so it does turn off by itself after a period of time. Okay, it does seem we have to go in this particular direction for the time being. Whoop, there's a big one. Hello. How you doing? Oh, he died immediately! I do like how there's a different death theme for every area. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? So there's a big one down there, and it has some punch. Okay, that's took care of those two. No contest. We've got to keep our eyes open for the carkin, whatever that might be. Keep our torch on. Activated. There's one. Stop eating each other and just die. Okay. There's that done. I wonder what's in here. It's a wheelie thing. It's really good. Look at that wheel. Uh, it might be meant to, it might be like meant to be considered some kind of saw. It's hard to tell the light polygon sometimes. Okay, that seems all right to me. I'll jump over here. I'm gonna give that car kid another go. How's that? We might t try a different approach, however. You want to see how my different approach goes? Let's call it use grenades. Let's try it. Where are you? Hello. Oh, the approach worked! Oh, there's nothing left. Apart from a few chunks. Chunky goodness. Got a recoil mod. Just drop these grenades. Take that recoil mod, add it to my inventory. And then drop that because I can't use it at all. Okay. We got these lambs. These lambs are doing well. Checking out the area here. We are under the sea after all. But as it's a doom and gloomy game, we're not going to be saying, you know, it's just breaking into song or anything like that, we are merely under the sea. 
we let us now enter into this area because we now have the key. A strangely linear section for Deus Ex, gotta be said. And you're quite a quite a diverse sort of game. It's quite a linear area, but hey, every game needs a few linear moments, like this corridor here, apparently. Lights seem to be on in this area. Save our juice. So an area down there. Looks it's instantly non-linear again. It's like it's Deus Ex or something. Except that. We can't go through there. Sorry, wall. May have hit you unnecessarily. We are going to be conserving our clips, though, for our pistol, because our ammunition is reasonably low. Okay. Gotta uh, drop down here. There's a security camera at the end there. Fortunately, we have to fix the security cameras. It's called targeting. Wait for it to crouch in further, and... That was a little bit of a waste of, a waste of ammo from that such extreme range, but it does mean that that angry turret doesn't attack us. Because our keyring work here does not have the right code. That's concerning. Whoa! It's an angry turret! Well, fine then, angry turret. Be like that. Yeah. There's something here that... There may be guards. This place is meant to be deserted after all, but... Actually, what am I doing? A pistol is not going to do much to these sort of creatures. <laughs> Fire extinguisher, hello. Not much in the way of loot though, are you? Get out of my way, dude. Thank you. Tech goggles. Actually not as bad as you might think because it's dark. However, don't know if I really want to drop anything for him. So we're not going to. We are going to have to keep our mountains of credits. Newspaper. US situation worsens. Alright. With the declaration of martial law only 24 hours ago in the United States, the country's in turmoil and teeters on the edge of social collapse. Numerous governors, including Jason Fidley of Colorado, Gray Haddock of Tessex and Christina Licht of Carolina have refused to comply with presidential directive or acknowledge the authority of Walter Simons, director of FEMA. National Guards and other troops mobilized to quell domestic turmoil are in disarray as many units have gone AWOL. In a live netcast earlier today, General Ed Garner said that he would give no order, now allow any order to be given to those under my command that would lead to taking potentially lethal measures against an unarmed civilian population. He concluded by saying, our neighbours are not our enemies. General Gunn was immediately relieved of command by Walton Simons, resulting in the resignation of N.D. Cooper, Secretary of Defence. Reports that a detachment of UNETCO troops fired on protesters in New York City has yet to be verified, although several high-level sources within the government indicate that the situation may have degenerated to the point where UNATCO is no longer operating under governmental supervision. Similar reports have been received from Mexico City, London, Berlin, Paris and Moscow. Looks like Simon's been a busy boy. No other way to put it. Simon's been a busy little boy. Fortunately, we have arms. Arms allow us to get more pistol ammo. Now, that's a good find. We need that pistol ammo and add it to our inventory. We've got a pillow, too. Want to have a pillow fight? We might just do that. This is Deus Ex. You can do anything you want, including find a re... Another stealth pistol. We'll take that. There's a laser accuracy mod. I don't really need it at this point, honestly. Let's change the ammo type in this. Oh, we do have seven rounds left. Yeah, that's why not. Keep them there. Let's get the pillow. Okay, we got the pillow. Anyone around here? It seems to be a lift. Let's see if there's anything in the top rooms first. There's also this area over here. Okay. Pillow fight? You know I'm on a pillow fight? No, no, but oh, hello! I have a pillow. Oh, he didn't want to play. That's so annoying. Well, that used a lot of darts. Die. Thank you. 
as we know, tranquilizer darts the loudest weapon in the game. There's a medic kit there. Shame we didn't need that. Can't carry any more of those. Pepper gun. Reload mod might be useful. Can we apply that on anything? We can, a lot of things actually. We could take another 10% off that reload time there. This reload time's pretty good. Actually, we've not even touched it. Um, reload time on this is 4.5 seconds. Reload time on this is 2 seconds. Money just taken off the rocket launcher, honestly. I think we can afford to do it again on the rocket launcher, just to give it that 1.2 reload time, just to make it that little bit faster to reload. Because it does take a while to pull out, and that's what I'm concerned about. So, don't need the pepper gun. Don't need the human skull. Universal constructor nonsense. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's Dragon Fist Sword. Oh, darts. We'll take those. Add those to our inventory for sure. And in here, we've got a bioelectric cell, which we will be using. A candy bar, which we probably won't be using. Go, bioelectric cell become mine. Thank you. Alright, we've now dealt with the Karkin. Let's go downstairs again. So it seems that we haven't found a key for this area, but I am curious. I am very curious. It's a locked door of strength 4. Lock strength is 4, so it means 4 lockpicks. We have saved. Let's see what's inside. Is it worth 4 lockpicks? That's the question. It's a good question. I'm going to give you an answer shortly. Oh no, as soon as I know what's inside this door. Click that mouse left bus button again. Oh, now we go, it's so fixed. Okay. Contains supplies. So it's four lockpicks for... Uh -oh, cloak armor and ballistic armor. Now the thermoptic camo is not bad at all by any means. However, as we have cloak anyway, I think that this was a waste of time. And we've still yet to use our ballistic armor in this slot, because I keep forgetting about it. So we are going to leave it, as much as it's nice that it's there. And ballistic armor is pretty awesome in this game, with, especially if you've got high levels in uh, environmental training. An environmental training hero does really well, but uh, you need to build towards it. If I'm going to play Nameless Mod on this channel, which is certainly something I might do at one point, I might go with a disposable hero. Not by the man being disposable, but the weapons he uses being disposable. So we've certainly gone down in the world. Downhill. Let's save the game and probably head into a level transition. 400 skill points. It seems we've narrowly avoided a, a grenade on the wall. <laughs> There's the grenade. Oh. Now that we avoided that one, I don't think we could have taken it anyway, we're maxed. It's just a gas grenade anyway. Okay. Thank you, Helios. Interesting stuff. Hey, is currently using us against our will. Now we've got some choices here. We can either use the vent, or we can use this. The electric control panel to turn off this laser fence. I don't know about you, but I feel like a vent is in my future. Oh yes. I'm gonna unlock this vent right now. Here we go. Sweet. It's almost time to call it a video though. Climb these la this ladder here. Almost called them stairs, that would have been really embarrassing. We'll climb this ladder. And what do we have up here? Nothing. That was a, a lot of build up for not a lot. Maybe didn't notice this. He's down. Best we remain in our toes. 
down here we have another vent that we could use as well as this area here let's see what we've got available so we could, could go down here we could keep going around I think we'll keep going around and for now we'll call it a video when we come back there'll be more Deus Ex oh yeah <laughs>